Before parents are done paying off their loans, they're already taking on their children's, and it's sinking the entire family deeper into debt. America's surge of student debt is now at $1.2 trillion. It's absolutely terrifying. I try not to think about it. <laughs> Weighed down by their own loans, many parents lack the means to fund their children's educations without sinking even deeper into debt. Move back in with my parents for, <laughs> for sure and uh, try to start like a system of saving money and putting money away for paying it back and then money for moving forward. According to the New York Federal Reserve, Americans over 40 years old account for 35% of education debt. That's up from 25% in 2004. Adults from 35 to 50 years old owe about as much as people fresh out of college do with an average of $20,000. I think I'm going to try and set up a payment plan, definitely. I think I'm going to ask my parents to try and help me. We'll see. But I mean, if it's all up to me, I think I'm going to try and do what I can, get a job, try and pay that off as much as I can. I think it's going to take a while, but I think I could do it. Western New England University offers counseling for repayment and consolidation of loans for students entering and leaving college. The, the one thing that we, you know, constantly drive into them is that you need to keep in contact with your lenders. Don't just not make payments or not make decisions. By consolidating loans, it can lower monthly payments, but it could mean paying off your loans into your 40s. The Obama administration is trying to enable students to apply earlier for financial aid in 2017 so they can better plan and anticipate what their debt would be when choosing a school. Live in the newsroom, David McKay, 22 News.